Hey everybody, I'm Louie. I'm a motorcycle gear expert here at Jaffram. Today we're taking a closer look at the SB1 Polyurethane Motorcycle Sissy Bar Bag, available here at Jaffram.com. Sissy Bar Bags are a great way to add a very large amount of easily removable storage to your bike. Now there's numerous different sizes, materials, and mounting options available, so there's sure to be one to suit your needs. Now this is the water resistant polyurethane version of the SB1 style bag and it's available in black. And the exact measurements of the bag are located in the product listing. Now this amazing value includes the top roll bag and a full coverage rain cover at no additional charge. And the most important thing to remember with motorcycle luggage and especially sissy bar bags is that there really isn't a wrong way to mount them. And these bags come with a ton of mounting options, some of which you may not even be able to use on your particular motorcycle. But that's okay. And you may even come up with an arrangement that the manufacturer hasn't even thought of. And basically, if the bag is secure to the bike, it's mounted correctly. The main component to the mounting system on the SB1 PU is this lace-up sleeve. Now simply fit the sleeve over the backrest and tighten, and you're most of the way there. Now there's numerous straps and clips covering the outside that can be used however necessary. And they can be used for mounting the bag to the bike or even for mounting additional items to the bag itself. And the only limitation is your imagination. Now, I like to use them to secure frequently used items like perhaps rain gear or an extra sweatshirt or vest or even a tent to the luggage for easy access. Now if you use a luggage rack, take note of the weight capacity of the rack. If your gear is over the weight limit, no big deal. Just mount the bag backwards and set it on the seat. And depending on your riding position, you may have just created yourself a comfy little rider backrest. To mount the supplementary roll bag, simply feed the mounting straps through the roll bag straps and connect using the buckles. The cool thing about the strap system is that it's not attached to the roll bag, so you don't have to put the roll bag here if you don't want to. It's also a perfect spot for your bedroll or your sleeping bag. Now you still need more room for even more junk? Not to worry. The main bag expands to almost 200% of its original depth by simply unzipping this full circumference zipper. And the outside of the bag features four additional zippered pockets for smaller items, and the top pockets are fitted with straps for hanging items you want easy access to. Now, One of the features this bag doesn't have that some riders do like is an internal frame of some sort to make the bag rigid. And there's actually some benefit to this lack of rigidity in certain situations. See, I often find that I return from trips with way more stuff than what I left, and especially if I visited with friends or family. And because this bag has no internal frame, it can be rolled up and stowed in another saddlebag until it's needed. Now, if you prefer a rigid bag, but don't want to spend upwards of 300 bucks to get one, simply place a small rectangular container, like maybe a garbage can, inside the bag, and now you've got a rigid bag. Another feature included with this piece of luggage is the complimentary rain cover. Now, it rolls up small enough to fit into one of these small exterior pockets, but it's large enough to fit over not just the bag, but also almost anything you may have attached to the outside of the bag. Now, if you don't have anything on the outside of the bag to fill up the cover, be sure to wrap some bungees of some sort around the cover to keep the wind from tearing it up. Now, I actually will occasionally use two opposing cargo nets. Now, it's ugly, but it does work really, really well. Thank you for joining me for this closer look at the SB1 Polyurethane Sissy Bar Bag. To view more handy videos on motorcycle-related topics and products, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Jaff from Videos, or simply click the link below to go to our website. And don't forget to like us on Facebook, and remember, when it comes to our customers, we'll ride the extra mile. I'm Louie, and you'll see me next time.